Hello everyone, I'm Miss Barbar and welcome to Prism Garden, my planned coaster park. And today, before we start building anything, I have a lot to show you. First, I had a, I finished the backstage area now with small warehouse, something very si very simple, lots of parking because. Who doesn't like parking? And speaking of parking, I spent two hours last time on stream and we made this. Okay. We filled the parking with colorful car all around. And wow, it, it feels alive now. There's quite a lot of pieces. Still, still okay, but yeah, it adds to the piece count. But what I've been also adding, and you probably saw that if you came by the stream. First is this share of plane that is the area that we are gonna work today. And you want to finish that area uh, around the kaleidoscope and having a smaller attraction. I think it's nice. Also added some ATMs and some flower pots. Something simple, but it add life to the park and it fixed that aqua transition from the building so that is good then if we continue this is the biggest change i added a river rapid and it's some river rapid so it doesn't have a name yet but all this area i want to be somewhat of jungle temple team i still need to find the design i I want because I I want something that still feel unique. And I have some plan for this. We have this plaza with access to the entrance. And this will be some sort of restaurant. And we have the exit the exit of the ride. We have this area. Which is a path that We'll have some banks. Maybe I will need to see what I add there. I need to add something. Then we'll have all the Timmy and the interaction, which is nice. But I still need to figure out what I do in there. Could also add some chair and what, what not. Uh, just having a calm path and with some bench can be nice. And if we go outside, as you can see, we arrive near the restaurant with its last episode. And one thing I added is this, a nipper jump. So I wanted to thread the needle. I don't know if that's realistic, but to be honest, it's too cool not, not to have it. And I think there's enough clearance for the both of them to be there, so... That's quite fun, actually. <laughs> I will see if I can link the two of them, so... It will be fun, but since it's quite long, I don't want this to have too much weight, so... This will suffice. I still need to tame it and follow the line of what I did over there. But I think it's gonna be great. It was a uh, tree, some bench. And then we go back and we can see the river rapids below. I want to have two bridges where we can see that se section of the rapids that I need to team. And of course, completing this curve, there's the sundial. Because I love the interaction I had. I really want to push some interaction between the different attractions because I think it's really nice. We need to add the board there and all of that good stuff but first we have this area to work on and i want to first yeah i need to fix the water because it was a bit higher not if i can make it go high here with the terrain i will try if i can ship it and have a bit more water if i manage then it's cool if not we will adopt yeah, if, if not, I can try to have 
I am and then a little waterfall. We'll see what I can do. And I want to bring some of those rocks that are in there around all this area so it will feel complete. And then we will have a lot of work in there. I think it will take me quite a while. Don't know how long exactly, but this is gonna take me at least uh, two or three episodes. Need to find out what I put in Dark Corner. Having a coaster that interact with the temple could be really fun, but they need to go to the drawing board and maybe even a dueling coaster. I want a dueling coaster in the park, I really want to try that. And then if you saw the stream, there was, I tested having my... Well, I can go in there, my blueprints. An old blueprint that I did, but that I want to... Just to get the vibe is one coaster I did a long time ago for Park I never finished. But I like it. But there's some part I don't like, so I have to redo a wooden coaster with better track. And figure out what I do with this area. Anyway, enough talking. Let's get into a time lapse. <music> Okay, the chairplane is done, and look at this, oh, I love it. Went with something very simple, lots of flowers, because things are beautiful, and having so much flower, yeah, it's not. Then I add a lot of color, and this of the view added two little fountain, very simple one. As you saw, and uh, let's go into a digit cam. Oh, I need interface. Uh, funny thing is, we don't see the chair of plane and top. What I wanted. So, as you can see, we have the, the swing on the back, the sundial. But I changed the name of Gold, Gold Bill Swing, if I'm not mistaken. And I wanted to mostly hide them, of course. We cannot. Maybe I had a lot with that, but I wanted a tree to, yeah, we don't see mostly, we can see it move, but it's not in our face, it doesn't get from that view. 
same from the chair painted. We cannot really view, we can't see the frame, the, the structure of the kaleidoscope. And let's get on this path. But I've been busy. Did nothing with it, but I wanted to show you all the face. Also, I had to find some rock work and made that area complete with the same flowers. I complete the area quite nicely, actually. And let's go to the cool piece swing. Very simple thing. I wanted something simple but effective, so we have this mastered up. We and it's quite colorful. And there we have pots. And let's go to see. Ah, I think I'll touch you can cannot see it's very simple, just some fans, a floor to hide the ugly plank path, some pots everywhere like I and this concrete barrier to protect the Make it more realistic with the river rapid just at the side, I think. It's quite simple. Well, just just a wall with, with some pots to make it look like something. But it's just a small retaining wall in it. Stop having water and risking the stability of the thing. And the shower plane. I love it. I really have that area with the flower to remove some of the fans because I think it's more open and more welcoming. That's important. Okay, now I want to... On the next update I want to work on that bridge. Make a fancy bridge, play with the rock work and have something nice, maybe add some trees. I will see. Expand trees, yeah, all the way there. I think that would be nice. And then start working on this plant. At least that part. Want it to be safe. And maybe add some rock. I will wait for this brick because with that coming, there's a lot to think. But yeah, I will see you. In a minute, when this area is done. And this might be my best rain skin I have ever did. So, coming to this area, we have this wonderful bridge with some cover, and we can see the river up. I don't know if there are. Yes, there are. So, we can say. It and it's pretty safe, so that's great. Because instead of fencing, I decided to use some um, glass. And so, uh, what a view! What a view! You can see those beautiful pillars. And, and if we continue, we arrive in that area. Let me just take you care. Okay, perfect. So we have the right perspective. And look at that. That right skin is impeccable. So I wanted, I started with something simple, just some fans, some pots, and those concrete bits. Then I added, a tr I think I will remove that, those trees because I'm not. I like them. I like them. So we have a wall, we have those beautiful pillars. And can you use the attraction please? I want to show something. We'll come to that. Right, but look at the view. Oh, I love it. Not a covered queue. Maybe I'll show figure. Fix that, but again, it's a high capacity ride and it's okay if not everything has shaped. Actually, I will see. Maybe I will come and add some simple shit. But look at... Look at this beauty. It will start soon. So before it starts, let's... See. So I started this out. I had the same pillar design that I did 
for this. I had a, a little concrete slab and another one where this will be the evacuation point I will have a building on top. In case I have an emergency, let's imagine the desktop and they get stuck so they can get safely out of the attraction. Then we have this little area that I love. We have the pillars, we have some flowers, and a nice picnic area, which is nice. And good food in there, and all the way, that's good. But look what I was saying, we have a nice interaction with that pillar, and the gulpy swing. Look how close it is, haha, <laughs> that must be terrifying. Yeah, probably it's terrifying. And then, yeah, that's all the area. We have the bridge, we have some la we have some taller trees, we have a bit of nature around there, so it's nice, and you have that feeling of being in a jungle, even if it's not that big of a wood, but that's okay, it's still a team park. Okay, so that's all I have for this week. I really hope you enjoyed this episode because the park is really evolving to something great. Next time I want to work on this area. Probably uh, the coaster between episodes because I want to see how it will interact. But until then, see you next Wednesday. Leave a like and tell me in the comment what do you think of this all this area that we completed with two flat rides. Right, and that is really cool. Anyway, my name was Lucy, and goodbye!